Mr. Speaker, I rise today to celebrate the 50th anniversary of Medicare and Medicaid. For half a century, these critical programs have provided irreplaceable health and economic lifelines for countless Americans. In my congressional district alone, over 250 Arizonans rely on Medicaid for access to quality, affordable health care, while nearly 60,000 60, seniors depend on Medicare to cover their health care costs. However, this anniversary isn't just a time for celebration. It's also an opportunity to recommit ourselves to straightening America's social safety net. Instead of dangerous cuts, we should be considering meaningful solutions to the serious problems that Americans of all ages are currently facing. From the rising cost of prescription drugs to the unmet needs of our caregivers. Unfortunately, some prominent Republicans, including leading presidential candidates, will have you believe that we need to phase out these important pro programs. That's nonsense. Mr. Speaker, I can't imagine telling Latinos who rely on Medicare, half of them have incomes below $14,000, that we need to phase out their health care. I'm extremely proud to have fought for the Medicaid expansion in my home state of Arizona, and I look forward to continue to work with my colleagues here in Congress to protect and improve Medicaid and Medicare for future generations. Thank you.